All right, guys, Mr. H here discussing and explaining the iconic Predator biomask. So within the films, we see that these biomasks are able to access uh, visual frequencies. These are used for multiple purposes and most commonly used is an infrared and thermal imaging frequency. Uh, we see this multiple times during hunts on humans. However, this visual frequency poses little benefit against xenomorphs and generally speaking, the EM field detector is employed during hunts involving the aliens. There are of course various other vision modes such as health status detection and a mode that can specifically detect other Yautja even when cloaked. A predator can in fact create vision modes through the connected wrist gauntlet. If on a hunt and tracking prey the Yautja can insert a substance relating to his prey into his wrist gauntlet for analysis. This allows the biomask to temporarily highlight where the prey has been, combining high skill set and technology. So the biomask has another feature relating to vision, and this being an inbuilt tracking system. Connecting to the plasma caster, a shoulder mounted plasma cannon, the tracking system allows the predator to lock on to its prey before it opens fire. A notable feature and iconic unto itself is the three dots in a triangle shape which signifies the locking on process of the tracking system. And from a youngster's perspective they see a triangle locking and zooming in on the target. Once it is locked on the triangle itself will flash red. The tracking system can also act as a scouting aid and zoom in across long, long, long distances, allowing the predator to use range weapons to great effect, but also track from afar. So not only incorporating visual aids in hunts, the biomask also can record and translate audio. We have seen recorded audio used to great effect by predators uh, throughout the films, luring prey to their death and of course, fear tactics. The audio also has other benefits and can be used to study a prey's language which would be used to better the hunt and maintain success. The predator biomask also regulates atmosphere and sound. We see in predator that prior to taking the mask off the jungle hunter removes multiple tubes which exposes a gaseous substance coming out. This is in fact a life support system allowing the predators to breathe on any world they may choose to hunt on. Though they can breathe on earth, it is harder and they must breathe heavier. Along with that, it acts to cancel out audio frequencies for the Yautja, allowing them to hone in and focus more during a hunt. So the biomask also records video either for the predator to refer back to or for clan use. The bar masks are extremely durable, serving a dual role with hunting aids and protection in mind. They have been shown to withstand gunfire at close quarters. However, they are not so durable against plasma caster fire. With that being said though, infighting with Yautja being rare, this is not likely much of an issue. So coming in all, you know, many different variations and the Yautja often adorning and personalizing their bar masks, which is your personal favorite? Comment down below and let me know. I've got to say I love the iconic and original Jungle Hunter mask. Absolutely nothing can top seeing that for the first time. Uh, and I've got to say next in line, probably got to be the Celtix bio mask. What an awesome variant, even if you don't like the AVP movies. So if you did enjoy this video, and you got this far then please consider leaving a like as it does help the channel out and if you're new here then consider subscribing to stay tuned for more in the world of aliens and predator i've been mr h reviews and until next time i'll catch you in the comments section